Hi everybody, welcome back to Nellie Ruth Designs. Well, I'm a little behind, but here is week 14 in the Marguerite Miller 2024 uh, collage week uh, challenge. I'm always thrown because it used to be collage weekly plan or CWP and she dropped the P so I never really know how to, I guess it's just collage week 14. So I'd love to have you stick around and see what I come up with. Uh, I showed you previously the images that I pulled. This is from a, I think this is from a National Geographic uh, magazine. So I thought I'd use this. I have my map. We have to use um, something you see through a window, something with wheels, a map, something that uses electricity, something with a bit of orange, and then a name. And my name is tiny, tiny, tiny here. And I have khaki. This is the only thing you're going to laugh because I have been using the um, Daphne Diaries to make these. This is the only thing that is a, from a Daphne, Daphne Diary is the name khaki. I could not find anything that worked with these prompts here. So I had to go back to my old goodies, um, some of my vintage things. So <clears throat> I'm going to try to incorporate, if I can, this image because something you see through the windows is a neighbor. And I thought I would try to incorporate th this image here on the back side, if I can. I don't know if I can or not. Um, it appears, I don't know, He's. I'd like to have this little guy right here in the window, but then this comes down. So I'm just going to have to kind of see. And this is where I may run into some trouble. And it, this is a good, um, I guess, teaching point for my viewers because I could put it like this, but then little Johnny here, I'm calling him Johnny. It's actually Dick and Jane and Spot. Um, he is pretty much covered up. I could maybe put him down lower like this, and I would have Jane up here. So maybe I will try that. I'm going to have to cut this down to make him fit. I'm just going to try it, and if it works, it works. If it doesn't, then I will move on to something else. So I haven't, I haven't even really had a chance to look at everybody else's from 14 week 14 um, seeing that I just I just got back I am trying to catch up on videos I was able to watch a couple when I went on my elliptical this morning um, so that was good so I think I'd like to have this right about here like that so what I think I'm going to do in order to get this done properly is I think I'm going to maybe cut this right down through here maybe like right down through this area and then I can move um, Dick over I did see <coughs> I was able to see Pam over at Tattered Paper and Lace um, when I couldn't see much of anything. And I saw that this is the same week, 14, here we go, that she also used images of Dick and Jane and a police car. It was really cute, really, really cute. So I think that will be good. And then I can take, hopefully this is wide enough, I can move Dick. Maybe up and over here like this a little bit. Because I really don't need um, to have that part of the tree uh, Shut 
showing. I mean, and if I did want to, I could always cut this off and bring this down. Well, we got the door, we have that there. So that may work just fine, because it doesn't matter that he's a little bit taller. So I'm gonna cut this down here. Oh, let's see. I'll make a little. And again, I'm gonna use my cutter because I know if I do it with my scissors, what will most likely happen is I will um, cut it crooked and it would, might not fit. So I'm gonna get this on here, just like this. But first, um, my map, what I was thinking of doing with my map is taking, this is a wall, and I thought we could use the map as wallpaper. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this back out here. Um, I'm going to cut all of this out here and this out here, and then I'll be back and we will put the map on the back and that will act as wallpaper. So the backdrop is cut out. There is the little sink portion. And my thought was to use the map, like I said, as wallpaper. So I don't know if I wanna use, I think I'll do the top first and then I can go with, I don't know if I wanna do the green if I want green or peach wallpaper. So let's get uh, Jane on here. <clears throat> and get her in right about there. She, they're looking at the house next door is being painted. So they are, um, she's looking at the man, the painter on the, On the ladder and I'm going to take my own advice I'm going to take my because I lose these pins I'm going to put that right there in that pink eraser so I know where that pin is all right so let us get I think I will I guess I'll just go around this here whoops And we will put this here like this. And I guess I'll do a little bead right up here. All right. There, so there we have the neighbor. Whoops. Make sure I glue that down. I don't know why I cut that. All right. And then we have Dick here. Um, and I'm going to bring him down a little bit because I want his face to show. There's a little bit of spot down there, and he has an airplane. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna cut this right here like this. Okay. And I gotta cut it a little bit more. There we go. So we're gonna put Dick like that, right about there. All right, so I'm not going to do the top yet because I will pull that back and, and trim it, cut it. And I'm just gonna come up a little bit because I'm not quite sure how far, again, Let's 
So we have him right here like that. Whoops, I'm going to get this glued down because that is part of the window pane. I think that's why I sliced it. I wasn't sure if it was part of the window pane or not, but it is. And I do have to. I could have cut this whole window pane out and had the whole scene, but then I thought it would have just been really weird because this is the window over here that's opened. And I just thought it would be not look right. Okay, all right. And then we will get this cut right here. Whoops, it's not cut the top, Barbie. All right, and then we'll get this glued down. Okay, all right, that's done. Seems to be fairly easy today, but I still have a little bit more cutting to do. All right, so that is something you see through your window. You see your neighbors, and then we have... Um, do I want to, let's do the map next. So the map is going to be the bottom wallpaper. And I think we will, I think we'll use the, I don't know, we, we could use the green. But I think the orange fits better. I think the green is a little, a little harsh. So I'm going to, I'm going to cut a piece right here. Where's my pencil? Okay. All right, so we're going to cut here. And we're going to cut down. Let's just cut down to here. Where's my mark? Oh, here we go. And then we can come up here. All right. Get that on. Oh. I don't have much to report. I've reported everything and I'm just looking forward to the weekend. I don't have anything planned. Um, nothing is planned. And I think I'll just cut a little strip down here. Yeah, that's good. Um, I do want to go. I do want to go with my daughter-in-law, though, and she's very good with make. I don't wear makeup. I can't wear eye makeup anymore, mascara or anything like, because it bothers my eyes. And uh, but I've noticed that as I've aged, my the tone of my face, you've probably noticed it in my videos, is it's not that good. Um, so, and I'm, I don't like paying for, I don't like paying for makeup. I think makeup is way overpriced. I think it's a big racket. But I do need uh, one of those natural toners where it evens your skin out and it makes you look halfway decent. So I asked my daughter-in-law, she would go with me to um, Sephora, 
we don't have a lot of places in our area anymore that has like makeup consulting and stuff. We used to have a Bonton and what was the other one we had? We had a place called Magrams. They're, they're, they've all gone by the wayside. And I took my granddaughter, um, my Florida granddaughter, <laughs> to Sephora for her birthday last year. We always take her shopping. Oh, my Lord, I'm just glad that I gave her money. I put money in her hand and I said, here, sweetie, <laughs> pick out what you want because it could have gotten so out of hand. And what she bought was just some basic thing. I mean, she was very good. She, you know, she knows how to make a dollar stretch. Um, and, you know, she got everything that she wanted, but man, oh man. I was flabbergasted. So I told my daughter-in-law, I'm like, you have to come with me and help me because I know those women are going to try to probably sell me everything under the sun and I don't want that. And you will be able to, you know, say yes, no, I just want a foundation or something, a light, a light foundation um, to make me um, a little bit better. All right, so I got to think here. I want this, I want her holding on to this car, so I think I'm going to have to come here, right? Um... All of a sudden, I feel like I've forgotten how to do this. Yeah, and then this comes around here like this. Isn't that funny when you're, you don't do something for a while. I don't know, I just feel like, am I doing this right? Okay, so I had to cut through a couple, yeah. So, oh, and I have to cut this all out too, don't I? Yeah. Her hand, it's funny. She looks like she's got a... It doesn't look like she has a baby hand after I've cut this all out. So, we have this, and we can slide this car now. Is that going to work? Her hand is kind of... And I think i got to come up here a little bit. Yeah, we. <laughs> oh, way to go. Way to go, Babs. Way to go, Babs. Hmm. See, it's like having a, you know, it's like having a little piece of skin on your. And then you have a hangnail, and you rip that hangnail off, and that hurts, doesn't it? That hangnail hurts. Silly girl. Let's see if I can. Let's see if I can mend her. Either I have to go look for a band aid. Otherwise, I'll have to go look for a band aid. God, I feel like I'm doing surgery here now. You ever see those people on Instagram that um, 
make those doll, those miniature doll houses. Oh, Lordy. They are just amazing. All the little tiny, tiny pieces that they have to fit together. Um, it just, I'm in awe of it. That's what I feel like I'm doing here. Just, all right. So I got this here. This hand is really funky. It's like a man hand. An adult man hand. Poor child. Ha! <laughs> okay. All right. I'm going to leave it. I think that is good. I think that's good, right? Yeah, she's holding that car. That's pretty good. All right. I'm going to move this away because I don't think I have any more to cut. Okay. Boy, I feel like it's taken me forever. Now, I have this here, this tomato that she could be reaching for. And I have these, these little peaches that maybe this little peach might fit better um, one peach looks kind of funny there, doesn't it? Maybe I could put, I could put those two peaches like that. All right, so let's do that. Let's put this one here. And let's put this other one here. And I think we're done. Oh, no, I have to add her name. I have to add her little name. Okay, so there's her little, the little peaches and her name. And I think I'm going to put it, what's been stitched right on her, right on her little outfit here. And here is my um, Daphne's Diary contribution right here. <laughs> okay. All right. So, whew, got through that. Um, I'm going to get it in my book. Where is my book? My book is right here. And I think I said I was going to put it on the one where there was white correct I could put it right here as well I am putting it in this right or did I make a mistake oh no that was that one this isn't Daphne oh my goodness this is not this is my bird book oh so I am so confused all right so I think I really I think I really botched this up because this is my oh this is my Daphne's diary. See, can you tell? Or no, this is my um, Marguerite Miller da Daphne diary. Oh my God, talk about being Daphne, Daffy Daphne. I am not with it at all, people. I'm so sorry. So now what I have to do, <laughs> dummy, um, I got to cut this down to fit in my Marguerite Miller book. I told you, it has been, I've been away too long. So we are going to cut, we are going to cut this white off. I don't know what I was thinking. You're all probably just sitting there scratching your head and saying, what in the world is this girl doing? All right, so we're going to take, I can't take too much because I'd be cutting those peaches out of mama's hands. Um dummy. <laughs> All right. See what my family has to put up with. All right. We have that. Um, 
No, don't pull it. Do not pull it, you silly thing. If I pull that, I'll rip the whole page. I wonder if I can. I'm going to leave that like that. Oh, I am so silly. And I think this will fit here. And I gotta take a little bit more. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, caramba. What did Ricky Ricardo used to say when he got upset with Lucy? All right, there. Oh, good heavens. Now I better go back. Yeah, I'm putting them, I'm not putting them back to back. <laughs> you silly, nilly, ninny. Oh, good heavens. You're probably all yelling at me like, what? What are you doing, girl? And I'd be like, what? Yeah. That's what happens when you've been away. All right, so it's down, it's good, I'm all set. And um, so let's go through, I already stamped it um, April, this is number 14. I don't know if this is April, was for March or April, I don't know. Um, and then I stamped it here, so I know this goes with that. So something you see through a window is the neighbor's children. Uh, and something with wheels is the little toy car, a map is right here um, for the wallpaper. Something that uses electricity, I didn't do. Something with a bit of orange are the peaches that she's offering khaki, and then a name, which is her name. So I wanna thank everyone for joining, and if you're new to my channel, welcome. I so appreciate you. I think you'll have fun. This normally doesn't happen, uh, but like I said, I've been away for a little bit, and it does take it does take a little bit to get reorganized in your mind and and sometimes we have so many projects going on I don't know what book is what's supposed to go in what book obviously um, and to all my returning subscribers thank you my patreon uh, membership gals over there um, thank you for all your support and um, I hope you like what you're seeing over there. And yeah, that's it. Have a great weekend, everyone. I'm going to already have week 16 out because week 15, if you remember, I already did. So there won't be a week 15 on Sunday. I did it. That is the one where we had the matching pattern. I think it's, yeah, week 15. I, this could be week 16. I don't know. I'm so confused. I've got to get my head wrapped around the Marguerite Miller because I went out of, I, I went out of sequence. Now I'm doing 14. Now I got 16 in front of me. So maybe this weekend, maybe this Sunday is 16. I don't know. But in this video, I will also put week 15, okay? Um, I think I'm going to have to go back and watch. I did watch Pam over at Tattered Paper and Lace, and she had put her week 15 up because she had a repeating pattern, which were leaves on a flower. So I'm going to have to figure this out. So you may see me on Sunday. with If it's 16, you'll see me. If not, if it's 15, I will put the link in 14 here. You get the idea. I, I am so confused. So thank you again, everybody, and I will see you more organized in my next video. All right, bye-bye.